Yo, what is going on? Welcome back or welcome to the channel. Um, we are here today with episode 7 of our Pokemon Legends Arceus playthrough. If you didn't see the last episode, go check it out so that you can know how we got here. Um, currently, we're rocking a very similar team as we have in the last few episodes. Buizel, Mime Jr., Luxio, Staravia, Drifloon, and Dartrix. Um, we're here right in front of the tree where I think... I think we're gonna fight, um, Cleavor today, but we'll find out. I'm pretty sure we're gonna fight Cleavor today. Um, here we are, talking to Leanne about Cleavor a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I agree. Throwing f food at... <laughs> this guy has great yeah, reactions. If you didn't see him in, like, the last episode, he has some amazing reactions, like, I, yeah, I have to take a picture of that. His mouth just wide open, eyes widened. He has that perfect YouTuber thumbnail reaction image face when he does that. Ah, uh, and then we, there we've got Irida. Irida? Irida? I don't know. Uh, trying to make sure to stay hydrated because that's very important. Y'all should make sure too as well. Okay, yep. Talking about the Galaxy team and how they don't they don't trust us completely. Oh, are we gonna fight? Wait a minute. Um, Glaceon. Glaceon. What do I have for Glaceon? I have nothing for Glaceon. Well, I feel like that Glaceon animation was very fast. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna probably swap. Just kidding, Mr. Mime's just gonna die, or Mime Jr.'s just gonna die, actually, without an even chance. Um, these two can't, these three can't do anything, I probably should get rid of, I don't need three flying types on this team, I'm now realizing. Um, who's my best bet? I feel like Luxio's probably my best bet to take on Glaceon. Yep, um, we're gonna go for the Thunder Fang. I feel like that's going to be our strongest move. Oh, yeah. That's some good damage. Yep. There's another one. Swift. Oh, my God. Swift did half of our health. Why is that so strong? There was no way Mime Jr. was going to be able to live that. <laughs> Hope she heals me up after this, because I don't want to revive my Pokemon after use revives. Move mastered. Okay. Interesting. Um, simply your tools of choice, not products for, of disregard for Pokemon. You still understand the Pokemon that you've caught and treat them as partners. Um, I feel better putting my trust in you now, I think. Let me see to your Pokemon's words. Thank you. I like that most people in this game heal you after the battle with them. Because it's just a little quality of life thing. Yeah. You know, we're looking... That's what our strategy is, Irida. We're looking at... Mashing all the food together, make a little smoothie, and then throw it at him. Yeah, those things. Or bombs. I guess you can call them bombs. Um. I. Um. I'm gonna just say I'm ready. We're just gonna go in. <laughs> We're gonna do it. I don't know what typing Cleavor is. If I had to take a guess, he's like rock and bug or something like that. So, Weasel might be my best bet against him for, like, dealing damage. But, I don't know. Oh, Grasha. <laughs> Is that what Cleavor says? He says Grasha. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Can we get an image for the thumbnail of Cleavor? Oh, there he goes. He's Sonic, I guess. Wait, give me that image. Oh, there we go. Perfect. <laughs> oh, there we go. That's even better. <laughs> I'll be honest. I take, I, I'll take screenshots of here and edit them together to make a thumbnail. Um, claim you have to throw bombs. Yeah. Okay. We 
We got him. I don't know how I dodged that one. Oh, he got me there. I disagree with that one. Okay, I don't know how he keeps hitting me through the trees. And... Whoa, why did it turn around? No, 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 I need to gamer focus. Wait, what? Did my Joy-Cons die on me or something? What's going on? No! Oh no, oh no. Nope, let me go. Um, God, aiming with these Joy-Cons are so hard. Okay, okay. Just kind of peek. Just kind of peeking. Oh wait, am I allowed to do po do like the like, Pokemon now? Okay. There we go. Okay, I actually listened to the prompt this time to send in a Pokemon to do a battle. I was just trying to... Okay, so... Um... Will Strong Style really do much for me? I don't think it really hurts me that much. I've been taking some of my PP away. Yeah, he's a rock type. Ooh, okay, that did half. Adopted a hard hitting. Wait, what? That's not double. What double hit does? That's not what Stealth Rocks does. Okay. Um, I think one more strong style Aqua Jet though should take him out. Actually. Let's go, Buizel. Yo, Buizel. Come on, we're almost there. Nope, let me out. Oh, wait, what? Wait, what? Oh, wait, is it one of those lose in the cutscene or win in the battle, lose in the cutscene type of things? Oh no, we win in the cutscene. Let's go. Yo, poggers. <laughs> I like to take the pictures. Oh, there he is. All in his glory. Yo, look at all that XP. Oh my god. Yo, Mr. Mime got a new or Mr. Mime Jr. got a new move. I'm so used to seeing Mr. Mime. I'm just it's ingrained into me almost. Look at him. Oh my god, he's so loud. The insect plate. I mean that makes sense. Yeah. Bug Pokemon. He's bugging rock. I guess I was right. Yep. I mean, sure, that works with me. <laughs> I just barely won that. I thought I was dead. I so thought I was dead. This, oh, I'm so glad that I haven't actually died at all in any of these episodes. <laughs> like I had the one mistake with um, Weird Ear, but yeah. Strange Lightning, yeah, that probably was what messed him up because you know if I got struck by lightning I'd probably be acting a little bit different honestly <laughs> I'd probably be acting a little wonky I definitely wouldn't be happy that's for sure because that's not a pleasant that is not a pleasant experience at least not from what I understand <laughs> she's just telling Leon like stop being stubborn he did good even though you didn't do anything, it's all fine. It'll be okay. <laughs> At least that's what I'm understanding based on what I've been reading through. Oh, what did we get? Three sit. that's all. Really? Okay, I mean, I guess the healing's also not nice, but we literally got hit once. 
Okay. Wow. Hmm. Okay. I guess we go back to camp. Um, I might try and swap out some of my Pokemon. Because I realized how weak I am to rock right now. That's not what I meant to do. Um, I want to see my Pokemon. What Pokemon will you bring with you? Um, I don't know. I think I want to get rid of Staravia. Yeah. And grab maybe... Maybe a Baneary or something. Just not something that's weak to rock, that's for sure. In between episodes, I need to... Um, oh, wait, you can already have it moves mastered? Interesting, interesting, interesting. I'm going to grab a Baneary for now. That way my team's a little more balanced. Like, types-wise. Because now we only have two Pokemon weak to rock. Sure, we can go ahead and report the survey results. Um, yeah, I didn't really catch anything, but that's just because... There wasn't really much to catch, I just beat up Cleavor. Yeah. Ooh, we almost have the max on Luxio. Um, 8 out of 8 with Krikatot, 4 with Psyduck. That's not bad. Yeah. Now I'm allowed to move on to the next rank. Though. Now that I've... I think... I'm assuming the ranks are probably, like, locked behind certain story events, which is why I wasn't able to rank up last episode. Because I had the points for it, but... Yeah. I don't know. That's really odd. Odd choices. Two of the fabled plates of old. I don't know what they are. <laughs> I'm assuming they're just something to deal with Arceus later on. Where all creation was born, that is the being's place of origin. Which one says that? <laughs> How'd you come across these? Well, these Pokemon just gave them to, them, to me. My heart's racing with excitement. It is my guess that you will find more plates like these scattered across Hisui. If we were to gather them all and decipher the scripts on them, we may uncover something absolutely amazing. The mysteries of the past. Oh, how they tickle my curiosity. What a joy to be alive in such times. Well, I must be on my way. Until next time. Okay, well, here we go. Um, in between episodes, I'll probably release some Pokemon just to make a little bit of space. Because I don't need that many <laughs> Pokemon just sitting around in my storage. Because that's, yeah, that's completely unnecessary. <laughs> Okay, well, up we go, I guess. Um, I wonder if we'll be able to show that girl the Psyduck, or... No, it was Geodude, I think, that she wanted to see. Was that an Eevee? <gasps> There's an Eevee! That's cool. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Okay, well, up we go. Hello, Komodo. Oh, I don't even walk in. Well done. I already received the reports of your exploits. You successfully quelled Cleaver's feet. Frenzy, restoring peace of mind to Hisui's people. You are a stranger to us. One who fell out of the very sky. God, come on guys. I know I fell out of the sky, but that's not the only thing about me. I have other personality traits, other than being an Isekai protagonist. Like, it's really, it's getting, like, out of hand here. My goodness. Frenzy of the Lord and... Frenzy of the Lord of the Woods. Okay. And we completed that mission. Now we go eat with the at the racist man's diner or whatever. Mm-hmm. What? I wasn't lo well, I mean <laughs> I disagree that I was well prepared. I came in there very stubbornly with three Pokemon weak to it. At well no, actually four. Four of my Pokemon were weak to its typing combinations. Smoke bombs. What are those for? Why would I need the smoke bombs? Hmm. I don't know. It's an interesting thing. Oh. What's that? 
There's something real important I need to tell. Um, that's, um, I don't like this. I'm getting a little stressed out right here. Um, <laughs> I don't know how to feel. Something terrible has happened to sweet what? Being that Brock Clamity was made by strange magic, the magic is... How does this little girl know this stuff? Uh, yeah, I, I, I don't believe you. You're just some small child. Oh, the odd keystone? I mean, sure. This, is this how we get spirit to him? Whole bunch of wisps. Oh, this is probably like a side quest thing. And that's how we eventually get spirit to him. Interesting. I don't know if I'm going to do that for a while. Uh, touch the flame. I'm not an idiot. I'm not about to go touch fire. I Well, I probably don't have a choice here, actually. <laughs> I probably don't have a choice. I probably have to go touch the fire. So I'm guessing this is what the wisps are going to look like. Come on. Okay. There we go. <laughs> I couldn't grab it for some reason. I don't know why. Ooh, I just hit my headphones on accident. I wasn't very smart. I need to make sure I'm doing the right thing for this. Um, okay. As you gather more and more wisps, I'll give you more rewards. Thanks. Okay. Whatever you say, little girl. Even though I feel like you're somehow not. Okay. <sighs> now can I go to sleep? <laughs> the next day. Oh, stretches. Oh, the music in this game is so pretty. It really is, dare I say. Oh, that's like the Mars haircut. What about it? Um, uh, since I was chosen once, some people are actually kind of scared of you for doing something so bold. I mean, I guess in this society that makes sense. Erizu? Erizu? I'm a warden. My special skill is giving haircuts. Oh, we can get good haircuts now? Erizu's predicament. Wait, what? I want a new haircut. <laughs> I want. Uh huh. I'm gonna... I, I would like a new haircut. I wanna see if there's anything new. If there's not, I'm probably just gonna stick with this and I probably just wasted 500 polka dollars, but I'll be fine. I'm sure there's new. There's... What? What? Okay. I guess I don't have a choice. I thought there'd be more hairstyles than this. Oh well, I guess I'm just gonna stick with what I've got already. Here we go. Um, I know there, I think I saw a few more like side quest type things that were just around, yeah. Here's one from Tau, Tau Hua. Mm-hmm. God, there's so many side quests. They're everywhere. I'm just gonna stick with the main story right now. I'll do the side quest some other time, maybe. <laughs> maybe on my own time, I'll just do the side quest. Yeah, that might be how I do it. Cause I know, I know it's probably not great content to just watch me do a bunch of side sideline story type things. Um, is that Geodude girl in here? I don't know where that Geodude girl went. There was a girl in one of the episodes that had a request just to see a Geodude. I was like, oh, okay, and then she just disappeared on me. So, I didn't know what to do. I don't know where to find her. 
I mean, if anyone knows, like, let me know in the comments, because it's honestly quite annoying that I don't, I have no clue where to find this character. And yeah, I just feel stuck almost for trying to move forward. Uh, team Galaxy, or Galaxy Team. God, I want to say the word team first, because that's what I'm used to. Because Team Galactic, Team Rocket, Team Plasma, Team Magma, Team Aqua. It's always the team first, but not... It's not Aqua Team, or Magma Team, or Rocket Team. No. They always say Team Blank. Um, well, I mean... If I need to be a second star with Silene, then just give me my second star. I'm already strong enough. Well, I think I've completed enough research tasks. I guess that works. Is that, are we at second? There we go. There we go, we got our new rank. Let's go. We're making a lot of progress this episode. Taking on Weird Ear, getting our second star. Feather balls. I'm gonna guess that those can like be thrown from far away or something like that. Apricorn and a sky tumble stone. Super potions is a potion and a peppa plant. Okay. Now the Crimson Mirelands. Destination is a place within the Mirelands known as the Salacion Ruins. Oh, I remember Salacion Town, I'm guessing is where kind of like where we're going. Okay. That makes sense. Oh, nope, I was going the wrong way. I don't know why we need to go through this door, though. Oh, this just took us straight outside. Yeah, I'll worry about side quests on another, on my own time. For now, though, I'll just, I'll stick to the main story while I'm, like, playing through it for content. But, just now, I'll probably do those on my own time. Whenever I feel like playing the game, but not recording, you know? So, yeah, I'll probably just do that. I'll probably level up, maybe just, oh wait, we're battling, what? Oh, that felt sudden, I just didn't. Wait a minute, he has a Mime Junior. He copied me. No, this is personal now. Okay, no, forget whatever I was talking about. This, is, this has now become a personal matter. He, he's trying to use a Mime Junior. Little does he know, Mine Jr. is actually quite bad. <laughs> I like the way they changed sleep, though. I talked about it in one of the others. I like the way they changed it to where it's all kind of similar to per- What? Wait a minute, what? Where'd he get that move? You know what? Actually, I don't think I can really- Oh, that must be Zen Headbutt. I just got- I just got Zen Headbutt, so... I'm assuming that's what he used. Um, let's go for Astonish. Wait, what am I gonna do against Pikachu right now? Hmm. I don't know what to do against the Pikachu here. Oh, wait, and he just Agile Style. Oh my god, oh no. <laughs> wait a minute. Oh no. And then into the Thundershock. Um, I need to slap. Um, Luxio. You're probably my best bet for dealing with this, honestly. I would be using Mime Jr., but my Mime Jr. is a little underleveled, so... Yeah. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and revive Baneri, though, so that Baneri can get some XP from this fight. Because, yeah, Baneri is just insanely underleveled. I didn't know I'd be going straight into a battle. Agile Style. What are you... Agile Style Quick Attack. What does... What does Agile Style Quick Attack even do? Um, what if I use Agile Style Bite into a regular bite? <laughs> do his strategy. Come on. Yes, a regular bite will kill for sure. What? What? Why wasn't I allowed to attack again? That's stupid. That's so stupid. Oh well. Um, 
I'm gonna check my summary to see like how what's the big difference between oh my god my special my spec attack is so high I have an okay nature I guess is what it is what it comes down to the Zen headbutt definitely not gonna be strong enough to take out the Pikachu um, but a strong style confusion probably is actually like 80 something special attack there's no way yeah yeah there we go see see my superiority <laughs> I am superior me and my mr. mimer oh my god that smile that darn smile goodness oh um, but you didn't get as much um, XP as the others what are you giving me stealth sprays huckleberry <laughs> puckwort blooms space-time distortion things oh okay interesting interesting so it seems like those are like hmm I'm gonna sort my Pokemon out real quick because <laughs> I'm OCD like that let's do that and then I liked yep perfect that's exactly how I like to have them sorry um let me check your summary actually real quick what's your oh that's right there aren't abilities in this game are there oh that's right I have to I need to teach so change moves to see what Soren got he got aerial ice Let's get rid of Gust for Aerial Ice. Or no, I don't want to quit. Let's go and confirm that. Yes. Aerial Ace will be so much better than Gust. Even though we already had it mastered. Um, yeah, I think he's the only one that's learned any new moves lately. So... Yep, we are... Oh, the new area. That's so... Oh. Happy to be moving into a new area already. Then again, it's episode 7, and we're only just now going somewhere new. Hmm, interesting. Hope there are new Pokemon here. Um, one that I'd probably be looking for are probably like Croagunk. Um, I kind of, I kind of want a Chimchar on my team. Yeah, those are really the only two that I'm really looking for. If I could find a Cranny Dust, that'd be pretty cool as well. Or just any, like, of the new Pokemon. Maybe there's, like, a Goomy here. Because so I saw that one kid with a Goomy. Um, space-time distortions are dangerous places where powerful Pokemon appear. Well, if you're, you're brave enough to enter them, you might be able to find a rare Pokemon and I, Well, I'm gonna be brave enough every single time, buddy. Don't you dare test, test my resolve. <laughs> I will try it. Oh, let's go. What do we got here? <gasps> it's a Badoo! Badoo. I love Badoo. Hardy Grains. Yay, Badoo. Oh, I might have to add Badoo. But no, I have a grass type already. Okay, there's another Badoo. Um, oh. I swear it came out of nowhere. Oh, that poor Psyduck. I'm gonna take advantage of him. Um, not in a bad way. Um, wait. Officer, I swear. <laughs> not in a bad way. Oh, <gasps> Burmy! Yo! I like Burmy. Wait, this is the rock form Burmy. I should probably swap Pokemon. It's like rock and bug, I think. Yeah, this is the rock bug form. I'm gonna swap out. Bring in my Buizel. Do some damage. I like that swapping isn't your entire turn now. Oh, I was in the way. <laughs> um, ooh, that did a lot of damage. I like all the changes they made in this game, honestly, so far. It's been really good. And it seems like there aren't really Pokeballs that, like, increase your catch chance. Like, just straight increase like great balls and ultra balls oh burn me burn me um any other 
Pokemon around? <gasps> There's a Carnivine over there. Okay. I, I had to stay silent because I felt embarrassed about that one. I missed it while it was sitting still. Okay, quick attack. Some decent damage. Even agile and strong. Um, yeah, agile and strong quick attack. I feel like will kill. And then we do a strong style quick attack. The styles are quite interesting. Oh, oh, oh! There we go, Baniri. Let's go. Okay. I'm gonna walk over here. What are you? What is that? Bug word. Okay. Ooh, there's a carnivine. Oh, he saw me. Oh, shoot. Um. I guess we're gonna do that. Oh, no, my. Oh, well. Um, let's go ahead and go for Aerial Ace so that we can start to master that move. Um. I'm gonna try and catch this Carnivine real quick. And then I think we're gonna call that the episode right after we catch this little guy. But, oh, I just, Carnivine, Carnivine's not like a Pokemon I'll use most of the time, but he's, I like him because of his appearance in the anime with James. But, you know, I'm gonna check what Soren just learned first, and then we're gonna probably call it a day um oh magical leaf really really yeah i'm like because i don't think even with being modest i don't think it's worth it yeah our tax still super high well that's unfortunate but anyways um we're gonna wrap up here and in the next episode we'll make some more progress through this area of the game and hopefully catch some more Pokemon and find some of the ones that I'm looking for. Um, I enjoy, I've been enjoying this game so far. And if you are enjoying as well, um, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Because and, I'd really appreciate it. <laughs> That's really the only reason. Oh, and you get to see more. So, yeah, there's that. Anyways, enough with the rambling. That's it for the video. Peace out.